Okay, I'm going to go over this uh, CJ7. Um, it's a uh, 76 to 86 uh, CJ7 frame. Uh, virtually rust free, uh, straight, came off a nice clean running and driving Jeep. Um, here's top side of it. Uh, nice grease, well grease preserved uh, frame. We like to see grease on these because they actually kind of inhibit rust. Uh, a little bit of scaling there where the motor, uh, the chalk towers or the motor mounts, or whatever, bolted up um, there, but nothing, uh, no cancer down through here. Uh, frame rails are all in good shape. Um, let's see if I can pull these things. I'll get these things pulled, but those were obviously uh, still intact there. Um, We'll pull those off but this is one here so it's got a little bit it's kind of eaten into a little bit but not bad not for the age of it anyway um coming through the back area through here up where your gas tank goes that's all in good shape uh back through the back area that's nice and clean straight um this area here you can kind of see it's got a little bit of crack going on there so um that's the only area on it these back which is pretty common because it traps dirt back there um, to see but uh, I definitely would do a little bit of a repair back there and I'll adjust the price accordingly It's kind of hard to get these old frames This might be frozen to the ground One of the things we don't have salt here in Colorado so that keeps them fairly clean um, But uh, CJ7 frames are I'm gonna put down just for a second and flip this frame over So I can show you the bottom side of it like the ground came up with it so anyway uh, bottom side front area nice clean down to the sides again all the bolts pop loose where your leaf spring perches are those are in good shape down where your belly pan goes that's in good shape you can see the frozen tundra there I'll get that thawed out and pulled off of there just wad of dirt there but those are in good shape there and that one's frozen as well um coming up through that's the bottom side so nice clean uh all surface a little scaling but nothing major uh shackles will get pulled for you these mounts you can pull off and replace uh this is the area back here you start seeing a little bit deeper scaling here this is about six inches to the back and then here i tapped a little bit on this with a hammer um, everything's solid, but it definitely I would grind this down. I pull this off Maybe put a new cap on it. We can order those they are really cheap uh, Put a new cap on it and grind that down. You can put some pour 15 on it or um, or just cut it out uh, This that's this side's actually okay. It's this side. That's you can see it there So I'll adjust the price accordingly to that on these old frames It's really hard to get something that doesn't have this because this area here They box this in and it got they didn't have any clean out holes so all the moisture runs the back of these frames going forward most of its life obviously and they they like to eat themselves out through there so otherwise this be a grade a i'll call this a grade b uh frame um just for the fact that it is straight and rust free virtually 90 percent with the 10 percent in the rear uh, look throw that down there and give you one more overshot of it so any questions comments any other frame requests you can see all our frames we have here um most of our frames, even this one, still has a lot of the factory paint. JKs, TJYJs, uh, axles galore. 303-666-9020. Tons of drive shafts. We got tubs, roll bars. You name it, we got it. Um, we part these things out to the nuts and bolts. Inside, we have all the bolts, hoods, fenders, uh, grills, etc. So if you have any other questions, comments, concerns, 303-666-9020. And uh, we'll go from there. I do have one more frame. Um, I'm going to walk over to it. It's actually on this CJ here. This one's still complete. We just got this one in. This actually has an ARB locker in the rear on a 20. Uh, probably with some low gears. We haven't pulled the covers yet to see. But pretty fairly complete frame. Or uh, Jeep, excuse me. Um, and that side, this one's better back here um i won't know until i pull those areas off how you know but it is a common area to see weak there so uh let's see here yeah this one looks real clean so this one would be another one i'd, I'd probably grade this as an a but i'll get it out spec it in and make sure uh it hasn't been tweaked ever you don't know until you get them fully stripped down so 
but most of the time they're 90 99 percent of the time they're perfect so anyway uh yes yeah, jeremy jeeps unlimited thanks for watching